So, with me today, I have none other than Steve Shaw of Intel, our MariaDB Foundation board member, and we are going to talk about the value of sponsoring the MariaDB Foundation. Hi, Steve. Hi. Hi, Kai. So, uh, what's your, I mean, I know you are the father of HammerDB, uh, and you have a particular role inside uh, Intel. So can you share a, a couple of thoughts about both HammerDB and yourself and your position at Intel? Uh, yes. So, I mean, with, with HammerDB, for uh, my whole career, I've been focused on databases and database performance. And HammerDB very much came out of that work. So we were able to quantify, you know, compare and also help improve relational data performance you know on intel based platforms you know that fits very nicely my background in intel i was very much focused around the commercial databases for a long time but it was very much custom customer demand uh, a number of years back that completely changed my focus and now i'm entirely you know directed on open source databases you know making sure they run best on intel platforms and of course, for the popularity, MariaDB is a big part of that. Okay. And uh, you have a fancy title at Intel, I suppose. What's your, what's your exact job title? So my exact job title is uh, Principal Engineer. So there's, I'm not sure of, you know, quite how many Principal Engineers there are within Intel, but, you know, there's, there's relatively few. So it's... Uh, a grade that you aspire to attaining. Unfortunately, from my work focused around databases, that was recognized inside Intel. So I've achieved that principal engineer status. Great, great, great. Yep, so so now moving on to MariaDB Server, uh, how would you rate the importance of, of MariaDB Server as such? I mean, if you look, you know, from an Intel you know, perspective, if we just look, for example, at the number of Docker downloads, there's been more than a billion Docker downloads of MariaDB server. You know, the vast majority of those run on Intel servers, you know, and the vast majority of developers, you know, are developing on Intel-based laptops and desktops. So that would quite clearly show that MariaDB server is vitally important. You know, we want, you know, both users and developers to have the best possible experience of that software running on the Intel platforms. Mm -hmm. So uh, how does that translate to um, value when it comes to, to sponsoring? How do you reason in that area? I, I think it's, you know, it's, it's quite important in terms of, you know, of open source and the level of you know of sponsoring to ensure that continuity you know to have that entity that you can engage with you know so that we as intel have one entity that really looks after that software you know that we can engage with to ensure that customers you know running MariaDB get the best experience running on top of the, the intel based platform i think very much things have you know, changed, you know, to, to some degree, whereas we've moved from a model where you're you know, with open source, you're offering support, and, you know, and additional features. Now we have managed, you know, a lot of revenue is coming through for open source through managed services. So, you know, for us to sponsor is extremely important. So we have that one, you know, entity that sort of looks after the software across all of the managed services and running on-premise. On so we can ensure that when they're all running on the Intel platform, from our point of view, everyone is getting the best possible experience. Uh, so did you have a hard time persuading the rest of Intel about your reasoning? <laughs> that's a, that's a, gr a great question. You know, it's clear to an engineer, you know, it, it's clear. You know, we focus on, you know, software enabling and ensuring that software runs best, you know, on the Intel platform. So it's not difficult, you know, to persuade engineers, you know, of, of the value of sponsoring open source. You know, quite clearly when you have, you know, the, the business entity, that's where, you know, you have to, you know, explain and articulate, you know, in addition to the engineering, the value. 
You know, fortunately, Intel is a very engineering focused company. So that's why we managed to you know, persuade and you know, we can continue to sponsor the MariaDB Foundation. Uh, but you do not only sponsor, you, you create value through, through contributions as well and a particular kind of contribution. So what's your thinking on, on collaboration? Right. There's so many touch points of collaboration, you know, both code contributions and also non-code contributions. So just as a recent example, just this week, we're engaging with the MariaDB column store team, you know, providing you know, an Intel server, you know, access from you know, an immediate sort of request, you know, can I test out you know, my parallel algorithms on the Intel-based systems? So we set up you know, a server and provided that to, you know, to the column store team for them to be able to do that. You know, but also we get you know, hands-on you know, with the, the software as well. So we're always looking at the latest commits. You know, we're always using HammerDB to test performance you know, and giving feedback directly to, directly to MariaDB you know, about performance, both on the transactional side and the analytics side. Again, so that's, so customers and users are getting that best possible experience, you know, out of the box. So those billion downloads, you know, for example, on Docker, you know, you run that on an Intel platform, you can rest assured, you know, that we've already been there ahead of the curve, you know, and ensured that everything is going to be optimal when you run it. And what about um, CPUs and uh, like testing on, on new CPUs? That's a great question as well, because, you know, one thing we have, you know, now is CPUs, you know, are getting more complex. So we have, we've got additional features, you know, such as accelerators in terms of, you know, the Intel analytics accelerator and the quick assist technology, which all helps to, you know, run your encryption, you know, and your compression, you know, directly in hardware rather than in software. So this has so many you know, areas where, where it's applicable, you know, that we can work with MariaDB, you know, look at, run different tests you know, and experiments. And exactly, you know, we can collaborate and help MariaDB enable and improve the performance of the database. Again, so it just runs you know, out of the box. But this is the sort of thing where you know, we're right ahead you know, on, on the edge of, edge of the curve. You know, working with MariaDB, so it's the most advanced database software out there, taking advantage, you know, of all these ad additional accelerator technologies. So in, that sounds great. Uh, do you, in conclusion, have any uh, wishes or messages to other potential sponsors of MariaDB Foundation? I, I think, you know, initially, as we, as we said, you know, the, the model has changed. You know, if you benefit from, you know, MariaDB software, you know, just look out there, you know, for example, look at those billion Docker downloads, you know, see, you know, if you're benefiting from that, you know, it's important to support that entity that sits across everybody, you know, who is, you know, who is using, deploying MariaDB, you know, whether you have customers, you know, partners, running managed services, you know, that foundation model, I, I think, is very much the one where, you know, open source is going to underpin open source in the future. And in some ways, that's where MariaDB has really been, you know, trailblazing that, that approach. So, you know, if you want to support open source, you know, it's that way of giving back, you know, not just as we're doing with code and non-code collaboration, but sponsorship, you know, is hugely important. So then you have that you know, single entity that can protect open source, you know, both now and ensure that continues on in the future, no matter where you're going to run it. Excellent thinking. So thanks for those words, Steve Shaw, principal engineer at Intel and the father of HammerDB. Thank you. My pleasure. Thank you, Kai. Mm -hmm.